Yo, 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 what is up, YouTube? We are back at it again with the spicy one. This one is not my list. This is a list that's been picking up. Um, I just added a few little tweaks that I like, and we're going to try it out this way. Uh, this is Winota in Modern. Uh, for those of you who've been playing Magic for a while, even in Standard and all that, you know, Winota is a... Uh, she's something. So <laughs> we're getting into it uh, pretty straightforward. Uh, we got birds, elves, everything to try to ramp into, uh, you know, casting our Winona, uh, Strangle Root Geists, two mana, two one, haste, undying. Uh, so that way we can sack it to like Eldritch Evolution, go get Winona. We still have a three two with haste. Uh, Season Power Mancers, you know, trying to get to Winona or Eldritch creates more non, non human creatures. Rabble Masters, same thing. Smaller Copter is really cool because you can. When you cast a Winota, you can use Winota to pilot the copter and still get a trigger off just the copter alone. Two Voice Resurgence, really good against other creature decks, uh, and also another good target for Eldritch Evolution. Uh, what I'm messing with is some of the numbers are a little different than others, but I'm still playing one <laughs> Agent of Treachery because stealing people's stuff is still hilarious. Also allows you to steal a blocker, things like that, just to let you get in the for sure damage, win it through. Uh, land base, pretty generic. Our only little additive would be uh, a Cavern of Souls. Just when we're trying to cast Winona, you know, that last little dig, try to get her in. Other than that, our sideboard is we got two paths, two or three rest in peace. So just to kind of cover our bases with Dredge and some other creature type decks. Uh, three timely reinforcements, just because Burn's so relevant right now. Uh, three Avalanche Riders for uh, Tron, Valica, those types of decks. Uh, Avalanche Rider is really cool because we can Eldritch Evolution into them. Just creates great tempo plays. Um, two Choke, just because Choke's really good right now. Uh, one Night of Autumn for, again, Burn, Enchantment, Artifact Hate, and uh, like, like Graph Digger's Cage, things like that that'll stop Winota. And one Gaddic Teague, just for, just very good against things like Control and uh, Tron ETC. So this is what we got. Uh, pretty sweet deck. Uh, I mean, I don't think I really need to go into it too deep. I was just 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 putting it out there that this is a deck that I want to play. And if you want to see it play too, please leave a like, comment down below, let me know. Uh, if you want me to go more in detail about Winota, what she is? If you haven't seen her, if you haven't been playing standard, you know she's a non. Whenever a non-human attacks, you get to look at the top six cards of your six cards of your library, and you get to put a human card from them onto the battlefield, tapped and attacking. So the combo is, with that, we get to try to get Angrath's Marauders. They're 4-4 four, four humans, and whenever a source we control would deal damage to a permanent or player, it deals double that damage. So it just gets disgusting fast, and they do stack. So if you get two of these and you get in just like a 4-4 four, four in, you know, it's, it's a lot. It's 16 damage, I'm pretty sure. So <laughs> just to give you an example, because it doubles and then doubles. But that's what we got. I hope you guys like it. Let me know. Comments down below. Remember to like and subscribe. We are doing our best to get to a thousand subs on YouTube. I'm going to keep saying it every single video because I really want to get there and I think it'd be really cool. And yeah, so I hope to get you guys in the next one. And remember to like and subscribe. See ya.